Steam, uh, yeah. uh, we hear one word uh, which we hear almost like every day, mm. everywhere. It's the word Zen. Zen. Zen center, Zen stick. Zen is this, Zen is not this, uh, Zen is difficult, Zen is not difficult. Zen hall, Zen center, mm. Zen master. <laughs> 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 Zen student. <laughs> so almost getting sick of it. <laughs> You're sick of it. <laughs> yeah, actually, Natural. What we practice is mm. nothing. <laughs> but uh, uh, makes them, the word makes them, uh, something special. And, uh, and my question is mm. uh, did Buddha ever say the word Zen? What Buddha what? Ever say the word Zen? Every say? Ever, ever. Ever Buddha, say, yeah, ever uh, say. Ever yeah. say the word yeah. Uh, Zen. Yeah. Uh, and uh, if not, uh, or if y yes, but, or like uh, how this word appear and mm. uh, connected to kind of which aspect uh, from so many teachings from Buddha. Mm. Mm. Yeah, so sky never asked the human being to call itself sky. We call it sky. Actually, we, in Korean, we call it Hanul. <laughs> so whose mistake is that? <laughs> so, uh, well, actually, this line struck my mind so strong, so that actually soon I decided to become monk. Because I read this uh, uh, Zen teaching <laughs> in, uh, in the, uh, my university magazine when I was a student. And uh, one of them, uh, Sung San's uh, student disciple, uh, Sunim, uh, uh, contributed this article about uh, Buddhism, Zen, and Zen uh, Sung San. And then there was this line. Can you repeat again? Sky never asked a human being to ask itself sky. But human being named the sky, make a conception, hold it, attach to it, then suffering. And almost all the suffering is, has the same process, if you look into it, right? We name or concept it, human being make it, and we hold and attach to that conception, idea, opinion, and make suffering for ourselves. See, all this conflict, my own suffering, who made it? So even then, if that goes that such way with you, that becomes absolutely sickness. If we only attach to this name Zen or the conception of the Zen, absolutely. Zen Sung San used to call that Zen sickness. Because we have lots of ideas about what the Zen is about, what the Zen style is about, how can I become Zen master? <laughs> and all these conceptions make us sick because we attach to it. Exactly. So uh, yeah, it's very important to detach to any kind of concept. But, you know, Jimmy Sung San also used to say that, so we make our own suffering because we make all these names and the conception and we attach to it, so we create our own suffering. But Zen means we use this word to help beings, all beings, that's Zen. That's quite cool because you know, we, uh, there is a way to transform it into actually as a remedy, medicine. Even if this word can uh, make lots of suffering or you know, some side effect, but Zen actually means, because we also use lots of names, Zen means actually you use this word because people got disease from these all kind of names and uh, conception, idea, opinion. So we use these kind, these, all these things, word and the idea, and help all beings. How is it important to have this direction? 
Because anyway, we will not be able to avoid these old names and uh, conception, living as a human, right? But Zen means actually help all beings to use all those things. You know, it's like you know, in our temple rules that uh, a cow drink water, then the water becomes venom, poison. I'm sorry, the opposite. <laughs> Cow drink the water, they become milk. <laughs> Snake drink water, become venom. So same word, same idea, same conception or opinion. And what is the for? It is very important. We all, you know, put on this robe. Why? For many people, it looks stupid in this modern world. Not practical, not convenient at all. Why do you use this kind of robe, you know, uh, names? What, what are we doing during formal meal? Why don't we just eat? <laughs> Why should we wait until head monk hit the chukpi? Stupid. But, but there is, of course, what is the direction in it? Why do we use this form? In the beginning, I just said, you know, our body is already form. No matter you like or not, you yourself think, you know, this is I am, that's already form. It's not avoidable. So what's more important? Why is important? Why do we use this form? We actually understand, if your mind is simple, you already understand why we use this form. But when your mind becomes complicated, there are lots of theory, argument, and the smart idea so that your mind becomes very complicated. Then word, idea, opinion, form become disease, virus. It will make you sick. Right. So, uh, yeah, I think it's a very important question. We use all these kind of, you know, Zen, 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 not even Zen, right? How about don't know? How about put it down? Sometimes we are sick. Only if your mind is not simple and clear. So, yeah. Um, I had this kind of, probably, I think everybody has that. That's why you are sitting here. I had a, like a revolution in my mind when I you know, heard this line. Oh, my. Sky never asked me to call itself Sky, but because it was in the book, everybody called it. So I 100% believe that's it. That's Sky. But... That's true, human made it, and no one actually, I mean, I at least, I have not really proved it by myself, this idea or theory is true or not. And then I thought, oh, maybe that's not true. Life and the death, happiness, success, that idea I had about all those things, maybe not true. There was a revolution. So often, uh, Buddhism is used to call as a mind revolution. All you had it, all of you had it. That's why you are sitting here. Maybe you forgot it, the moment. So uh, uh, that's why. Yeah, so I think it's very important, yeah.